me your rank and your spell there for someone's name? Yeah, my name's Shane Carringer. Shane is spelled S-H-A-N-E. Carringer, C-A-R-R-I-N-G-E-R. -R -R -E I'm a sergeant, and I'm the public information officer with the Anaheim Police Department and Anaheim Fire and Rescue. Beginning with the time of the call, the location, this yeah, call came in just before 11 p.m. of a fire at a paper recycling plant here in Anaheim in the 900 block of East South Street. Uh, the first initial arriving Anaheim Fire and Rescue units, uh, as they got into the area, they saw smoke that was indicative of a, of a large well and barred fire. Uh, so they did call for additional units as they started those firefighting and suppression efforts. Their immediate concern was some new apartment complexes and condominiums that are just immediately to the west of the location. Uh, they called for assistance from the Anaheim Police Department. Uh, we ultimately evacuated about 40 to 50 people while firefighters ramped up their efforts to put out the fire. Uh, this fire grew to a four alarm fire. We were uh, supported by fire personnel from Fullerton, Brea, uh, and Orange County Sheriff's Academy in the city, or excuse me, the Orange County uh, Fire Authority and uh, the city of Orange as well. So after about almost two hours, they successfully finally got to a level uh, of knockdown, which means that the fire is almost out. Uh, they're kind of reassessing their position, making sure that there's no damage or no more exposure to any of the surrounding buildings. Uh, and then they'll keep putting water on that fire until they get to uh, what, what is called cleanup, which is gonna be going in there, shifting around all that burning material, really making sure that fire's out. Uh, it was a large fire. They're gonna be here for several more hours working this, uh, this incident. Luckily, as of yet, there were no injuries. And uh, I was just going to ask, uh, any damage uh, to actual buildings, or is this just contained to uh, the rubbish? Yeah, because of the strong uh, suppression efforts by all the fire personnel on scene so far, it is contained to kind of the materials area of this recycling plant, what would be the rubbish area. Uh, they have been able to protect successfully all the surrounding structures as so far. Great. And uh, this road is going to be closed down for a little bit, uh, and there's some adjacent areas where there's still firefighter activity. Can you talk about those areas? And yeah, there's a number of uh, uh, traffic impacted areas. East Street is closed off in both directions uh, surrounding South Street. South Street is, also, is, is actually closed off as well between East and Harbor, I believe. Uh, and there's firefighter and fire apparatus all in the area. Uh, they will again continue those uh, efforts making sure this fire doesn't reignite, making sure they can get in there and effectively put out the fire completely. And uh, the cause of the fire, is that still under investigation? Yeah, that'll be under investigation. We have arson investigators that'll come in, they'll go in there once the fire is completely out. They're experts in uh, determining what the initial location of a fire was and looking for anything suspicious that might have happened. Great. Anything else to add? No, sir. Thank you so much, sir. All right.